And we are live at the Green County Fair where we're having a really good time. Weather's cooperating, but there's so much more happening in Green County and specifically the Monroe area. We're joined by two members of the Chamber of Commerce here. We have Sandy Thomas and Marcy, Marcy Chacho. And Marcy, there's a lot going on. We're about halfway through summer, but by no means are we done with the excitement here in Monroe. No, there's still a lot going on in Monroe, Brian. So we have our Concerts on the Square series where there's still more concerts um, for the rest of the summer. And we also have, of course, Cheese Days. So Cheese Days is our big event in Monroe. Sometimes we bring in about 100,000 people for the weekend. And it is the third weekend in September in every even year. So it's coming up here shortly. This year they're doing something really fun. They are trying to get uh, enough people here who will all polka at the same time <laughs> on Saturday to beat the polka world record, which is currently held in Germany. So if you know how to polka, um, go on the website, the Cheese Days website, and sign up to become a polka participant. If there wasn't enough reason to get out the Cheese Days, now you can work on your polka and try to help break a record. Uh, Sandy, we were talking earlier as well. You guys have a big golf outing to kind of benefit the area uh, coming up. Tell me more about that. Yeah, it's our annual golf outing, which is uh, August 21st at the Monroe Golf Course. Um, it benefits the chamber. It's a fundraiser for us, and we help the community and the, the businesses and promoting them and just making Monroe the place where people want to come. Yeah, and uh, we're just getting through about halfway of summer, as I mentioned. Uh, why should people maybe make the journey down here if they're, say, up in the Madison area, the Baraboo area, wanting to explore more of southern Wisconsin? Of course, there are a lot of great cities. Why Monroe? Monroe is just a wonderful little community. So we're a community of about 10,000 people. We have a very vibrant square. Our downtown square does not have a single storefront open. Everything is full. Um, you can get things like, that. we just opened a brand new uh, wine bar down on the square where you can kind of serve yourself and do your own wine tastings. There's great shops, there's great restaurants. So Monroe has it all, just on a smaller scale than Madison. Love it, Marcy, Sandy, thank you so much. I hope you guys have a great summer and uh, hopefully people can get out here and check out some of the exciting things Green County and Monroe has to offer. If you are coming to the Green County Fair, well, it's looking good. Let's get to your first alert forecast.